Hey, what's going on guys? It's Johnny the House Buyer here. Today we are going to walk a property here up in North Dallas, right here off of uh, Lloyd and Northernmost. Going out with a uh, group of investors here. It's listed on the market today from Open Door. We're going to check out the house, run the numbers, and see what's going on. So first of all, let's t take a look at the, uh, the neighborhood here. Neighborhood looks like a really nice neighborhood. Uh, typically not the not the uh, type of neighborhoods I'm used to so that's a kind of an upper class neighborhood nice house uh, let's take a look at what it looks like all right so the front of the house let's see here everybody's inside looking at the inside I'm gonna check out the outside so I see the windows are good can't see the roof. I'm gonna step out. I'm surprised no one's on the outside looking at this stuff. Let's see here. What about these dudes? No, they're all right. Let's see. Roof looks all right. Looks good. We can zoom in a little bit. Yep. You can see that looks good. Let's take a look at the inside. Not much of the yard. Front yard. Got nice trees though, so it's a well-established neighborhood. So we're gonna look at the front door. Let's look, let's look, look at everything. All right. Left, we always walk left. Nice little entryway here. Yeah, it looks uh, pretty good here. Good. Got the kitchen here. Kitchen here. All right, nice flooring. And take a look at the uh, dining area. Kind of a small little dining area. This is the nook here. This is the dining area right here. We'll go walk through the kitchen here. Appliances look good. We got some old timey stoves here. Got the oven, got the dishwasher here. Got the uh, standard non granite. I would think it would be granite in this type of neighborhood. Looking at the backyard here. Backyard looks like it's got some superficial cracks here. Nothing serious, I don't think. Um, it's a very small backyard, maybe not good for kids. We'll take another look at the roof back here. If you can see right there, looks good. There's a little uh, Walk we'll pass through, take a look at the uh, utility room, washer dryer hookups. We can go into the garage here. The garage doesn't look too bad. Looking at, at the flooring. Uh, Got to look at the uh, water heater, make sure everything looks good. Doesn't look too bad, looks a little old. But uh, so far it looks good. Look at the uh, outside here. All right, this is where you don't, they didn't want you to see. Okay, so here's the driveway out here. Here's the entrance to the garage where no one's looking. All right, let's look there. We've got a big crack going across. I don't know if that's a problem. We might have to take a look. Let me feel the floors as I'm walking through. So this side definitely needs a lot of work here. Well, not, not a lot of work, a lot of cleanup. But as far as the structure of the house, it's a really stable house. Let's see here. OK, 
cabinets look good. Don't have to replace hardly anything in this house. Let's go upstairs, take a look. All right, taking my shoes off. Carpet looks nice. The view into the uh, living room from the top of the stairs looks good. Here's a little, little living area up here. Got a bedroom up here, so the bedrooms look up like they're up here. Let's see here. So this bedroom, it's a little bit, if it's a master, probably not, but this got a little bathroom in the bedroom, which is nice. Take a look at the bathroom. The water runs, it's got old fixtures. The gold looks like the 1990s fixtures. Um, looks like the house hadn't been updated. I think that's the only problem with this house. Okay, we're gonna walk into this next room here. Got the second room on, on the top floor. Maybe, maybe another secondary room. Probably not the master bedroom. It's got a nice uh, bathroom here. It looks like it's, they changed it out from the gold to the silver on this bathroom here. So they tried to do a little something. Got the fans, nice little view from the street. The windows look good. Floors look good. This house does not need much rehab at all. So that was the upstairs, so two bedrooms upstairs. Kind of a small upstairs, maybe. All right, let's do this. Y'all get a chance to walk the house? Yeah. All right, cool. Now we got the bedroom down here, the last bedroom. This looks like the, uh, got the, uh, last of the bedroom here. Looks good. This is the master bedroom, looks like, on the bottom. You wouldn't try this deal. So we were a little bit rushed on that one. I didn't get to uh, finish thoroughly walking through the entire house. The um, facilitator of the uh, meetup there was uh, about to speak, so we had to be uh, mindful of that. So I had to be mindful of that and, um, you know, be, be uh, respectful of, of everybody's time. So. Didn't get to walk through the whole house, but it ended up being that the house was uh, overpriced for a, a fix and flip, especially if you had to uh, borrow hard money. Um, it would probably not be a good rental unless uh, it was for uh, Airbnb, which is a po which was a possibility. One of the investors was thinking about making an Airbnb since it's close to um, a lot of different. Uh, amenities around uh, North Dallas. Uh, it was a nice house, uh, really good. It, it had a, a leak up in the ceiling that I didn't show you guys, but uh, it seemed to be fixed. Um, but you'd have to get a contractor out there. You put it under contract, get a contractor out there during your inspection period, uh, that kind of thing. But uh, other than that, uh, probably pass on that one since I'm not a big Airbnb guy. Maybe I should look into it, but there's other deals out there. So uh, thanks a lot for watching. Really appreciate it, guys. Uh, leave a comment below. Like if you like uh, these kind of videos. Uh, comment and subscribe. Hit that bell notification. Uh, be a light. Speak truth. Change lives. And I wish you much success in your business and in life. Peace.